leaps. What's going on, Gale Nation? Welcome back. That was a little quick, quick little, a little quick break. Little quick guys. break. I'm still a little tired, tired and lack of caffeinated because of last night's win. Chelsea Troublemaker Taylor Harris here. Radio Rabbi Allah. Yes, so it's Emilio time. Yo. It's that. It's that kind of morning. No sleep. No sleep. Too no hype. Were you all partying with the basketball team, Chelsea? Unfortunately, not because I'm on a um, no alcohol consumption. Um, till kick when? Till next Friday when I go to Cancun. Oh, so, makes sense. Makes woo, sense. Woo, woo. Will you leave to Cancun next Friday? Next Friday morning, yeah. think of me. I bl- I'm leaving JFK at eight ten in the morning. Hey, JFK is like five minutes from me, so wait. Same I'll wait here. Say, have See, fun. Are you serious? Yeah, JFK is like down the block for me pretty much. Are you, you live in Queens? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. I live yeah. in, well, you know where I live. Yeah, of course. I live like 10 minutes away from JFK. Yeah, I know. Yes, I Okay. Radio Rob talked to me because I was not thinking this morning. So we've got our Celeb News Roundup. And Kim Kardashian, she posted, did you guys see her Instagram picture yesterday? I did. I did. Wow. That's all I'm saying wow. is wow, right? So we all saw it. It was, it was a nude picture and it was censored. You know, she had black lines over her, her parts. And so she had a, p- a couple people coming at her from because of the photo. And yeah. one in particular was Bette Midler, the legendary Love Bette, Bette Midler. Midler. Right. And she, Bette Midler, she, was, she tweeted saying, Kim Kardashian tweeted a nude selfie today. If Kim wants us to see a part of her we've never seen, she's going to have to swallow the camera. Hey. <laughs> Right. Get so, it, Bet. She's definitely, she's definitely a savage. Sassy, my kind of person. And just in case you missed what she said on Twitter, Bet Midler posted on Facebook. I love she said, her. I'm gonna tell you on a yes. couple different platforms. You know real she's quick. old. You know she's old when she's posting on Facebook. She I mean, care. there's a there are a lot of old people on Facebook, so that you gotta true. hit your audience. You gotta hit those people, man. And those audience are probably in her favor. Because my mother is now on Facebook. So is she Yo! really? Well, she, she doesn't have her own Facebook account, but she's always using my sister's Facebook. Which I, I love so your weird. sister. That is it's kind of like weird. Like, my sister allows her to just check people's Facebook through her account. <laughs> God. Your mother kind of just stalks people on Facebook. Yeah. Wait, like, oh, Mario, okay, done. <laughs> does your mom have a Facebook? My mom has Facebook, oh, Instagram. Momentum, blah, 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 blah. Like, my mom, my mom is 40. I'm pretty sure she's only 40. She's young. She's young, so she's always on Instagram. Facebook, she's always doing all that stuff. So now we're we're getting back to the story, and um, Kim Kardashian comes right back at Bette Midler, and she's sorry I'm late to the party, guys. I was busy cashing my eighty million dollar my eighty million dollar video game check and transferring fifty million into our joint account. Hey guys, she she didn't take too long to clap back at her. She did not. We just had a comment made by our one viewer, Michael Demerges. Hello, Michael Demerges. Facebook Hello. is 10 years old, and we don't round to 50, so. And what? <laughs> <laughs> he only he said that Facebook is only 10 years old, and not only old people go on it, but who rounds to 50? <laughs> anyway, back to Kim K. I'm sorry about that. All right, and then Kim also tweeted, Hey, Bette Midler, I know it's past your bedtime, but if you're still <laughs> up and reading this, Send nudes. Hashtag just kidding. Send nudes. <laughs> Send nudes. So basically, you know, she's been taking some some brownie, some um, advice. Oh, yeah. So Kim is not. She's definitely going for it with Bette Midler. And she didn't, she didn't stop tweeting there. She said, hey, Bette Midler, I really didn't want to bring up how you sent me a gift a while back trying to be a fake friend then come at me. Hashtag deja vu. Why are you fighting with an old lady? She yeah. just keeps going at her. Her, she, her and Kanye need to be tamed. I'm over it. I'm, she, I'm over she, them. She, wait, she went at Pierce Morgan. She went at Chloe Grace Moretz. These are all the people what? that just, yeah. Kim, they have so much money, her and Kanye. They need to stop. And you know me, I'm usually a fan of the Kardashians. Love Kylie, love Chloe. They need to, Kim and Kanye need to just stop. I, they need to go to rehab. I high key like Chloe Grace Moretz, so I'm a little, I'm a little mad that she went at her. I'm salty right now. Yeah, great actress. <clears throat> yeah, she really is. She really is a great actress. So our God. next story comes from ABC News, and we have a new dance with the Stars cast. Or not. You want to go there? 
because I was going to talk about Beyonce performing for her daughter, but I think that's old anyways. Let's go into <laughs> the new Dancing with the Stars cast has been revealed. I hate it. You hate it. Well, let's, 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 let's say them first. Let's let them know. Let's let the people know. So we have, drum roll please, drum roll please. Marla Maples. Who's that? She's dancing with Tony Dovolani. And Marla Maples, you may know her as being married to Donald Trump. She married Donald Trump Excuse when? Excuse me, Irrelevant. are you kidding me? Um, do I know when she was, when was she married to him? Irrelevant. That's a great question. I, I'm going to have to find oh, that out. But she, she was a, a businesswoman. I'm oh, sorry. She's, she's a, an nothing. actress and a, t- a TV personality. She's nothing. So that is Marla Maples for you. Money. She's connected to the Donald. That's about it. Yeah. Next. Next. Who else do we have here? Oh, we have someone from Fuller House. Who? Yes, we I do. have it right in front of me. I'm so Jody excited about Sweeten. that. Oh, Jody Sweeten. Oh, my Lord. I Jesus. like it. That's relevant. She looks Stephanie gorgeous. Tanner. Have y'all seen Fuller House? Yes. Oh, my Lord. She's a bombshell on that. She looks, she looks Ready? Like amazing. She's definitely grown up. Yes, she There's has. another one. I have this we right have, in front of me, uh, too. Misha Barton. She's the only ro- the one I know. I like. I looked at the list, and I was like, oh, I know her. Who's a UFC fighter? UFC well, okay. well, Misha Barton, she's famous. Next, uh, the B- UFC fighter Paige Van, Z- Van Zant with Mark Ballas. Right. Oh, I've heard of her. She's like Instagram famous. Is that a boys to men singer on there? Yeah, yeah boys. To- you gotta Morris. shout out boys to men. You can, never can we go not shout out boys to, men. to the end of the road? Still we also okay. have here um, Geraldo Rivera. Do you guys know him? He's huh? a famous journalist. Famous also. I've heard of the name. Uh, he's on the Fox News Network. I've heard, I've heard of him. Heard of oh, speaking of journalists, on Ginger Z from Good Morning America. Love her. Yeah, she's the meteorologist over there. Love her. Um, Real Housewives of Atlanta star Kim Fields and Sasha. Kim Fields, I dig it. I mean, they, they always need, I feel like, a better match for this season, especially because of all her new fame. Teresa Giudice would have been a great addition to this cast. Maybe in the future, maybe like a Melissa, like one of the housewives of New Jersey, because they're more famous than the ha- Can she like the dance or the... Her daughters can tumble, her daughters can dance. Mm. So maybe, maybe next season, ABC, if you're watching this, you need Teresa, a housewife of New Jersey. Teresa Guido or whatever her name is. She, uh, Yo. whatever she's called. Teresa Giudice. She, she should stay off the map. I'm done with these housewives. I'm done with them. Cut them off. Make a stop. Done. Next. Yeah. yeah, I'm coming back to life, Chelsea, because these these housewife things are annoying. Watch, I'm gonna be on Housewives in New Jersey franchise. Oh my day. lord, if you, uh, oh, I wouldn't put it past you either. Honestly. I wouldn't put it past me either. I was, my mom and my sister want me to try for the real world. Anyway, lord. um, that would ruin my career in a heartbeat. America's Next Top Model winner, Niall DeMarco. Nope. It's America's Next Top Model. <laughs> Why are you getting ABC? I'm not impressed with this cast. At least like last year, they had some YouTube stars on there. That people that are actually kind of relevant. This Jody Sweeten is probably the only relevant one on this cast. I'm very disappointed. I have no like urge to watch it. The watch this season. It's unfortunate. It's sad because that's one of my favorite shows. I'm not Michaela Maloney from the um, U.S. gymnast team. Not impressed. Mm. Anything else you have for? So more of the story is, it premieres in a few weeks. I'm not looking forward to it. That's devastating for me because I've had people like Nicole Scherzinger on there, um, Aaron Carter, which is kind of irrelevant still. Carlton Banks. Carlton. Yes. What? It's so unusual. I'm not happy. Anything else for celeb news roundup? Nope, we're good. What about the, no Yance? Uh, no. Demer just wouldn't be happy with that. Yeah, so I don't really like talking about Yancey no more. No, Yancey. I'm, so what news lately has been boring. I don't know about you guys. I'm pretty bored by it. And I'm the entertainment queen. Mm, yeah. All right, on that And note. on that note, we'll be back. Break time. <laughs>